Hey gang, it's Ray Glasser once again from Cleveland, Ohio, and this is St. Patrick's Day of 2022, Thursday, March the 17th. I'm doing this video today for two reasons. One, this video rack is going to change tomorrow, and two, this is almost an anniversary for me because tomorrow, March 18th, 44 years ago, this is what I was shooting. That's right, what's become known as the world's oldest unboxing video, opening up my second Betamax, my SLO320, a Sony industrial model, back in 1978 on March the 18th. And uh, so that was like 44 years ago tomorrow, so it's a long time ago. But here we are shooting in 4K, showing my video rack. And the reason I'm showing this is tomorrow I'm going to have this patch bay removed. This is actually a patch bay for dubbing so I can connect machines from the front of the rack instead of the back of the rack. This side's for all the video connections. This side is for all the audio connections. And this is actually a patch bay out of a TV station, uh, pardon me, a radio station with the original wires. And they're actually stereo, which worked out really good. But uh, I need the patch bay gone because I need the height between here and up here because I'm replacing these two DVD players and this VHS recorder with a with two old Japanese Betamaxes from the early 1980s. So here, I'm going to take these two DVD players out. I'm taking out this Sony VHS recorder, and I'm replacing these two with the SLJ9, which I'm getting repaired, hopefully, and that's from 1981, the Japanese market machine. Over here will be my beloved SLJ7, which I got as a wedding gift for my wife back in 1980 which I finally got working after many, many years. Now, behind the video rack is what we used to call in the business a rat's nest. <laughs> These are all the wires necessary back in the day to go from one machine to another, wired to the patch bay, and it's a total mess. And tomorrow, 90% of these wires will be gone since they are wired to the patch bay. So, goodbye, rat's nest. The video rack, uh, a few months from today, probably will look a lot different than it does right now. So I wanted to uh, preserve this just so you can see what it used to look like. All right. That's about it for now. Ray Glasser from Cleveland, Ohio, March 17th, 2022. Take care, and we will see you soon.